Hey everybody, it's great to see you back. And today we're joined by my puppet friend, Baba Yaga. And Baba Yaga is a character from Russian literature. And she's a little bit of a scary character. She lives out in the forest in this hut that's built up on these huge chicken legs. And she is known for putting curses on people that don't do what she likes. However, she is also capable of helping people and caring about people. You just never know what you're gonna get with Baba Yaga. Well, you know what, sometimes you and I come up against a situation where we're getting negative, we're getting uh, maybe people giving us bad energy, and it's kind of like, hmm, sometimes the best way to respond is with a blessing. There's some mudra that is a symbol for blessing. It's called kataka. To do kataka, you traditionally use your right hand. Hey, Baba Yaga, do you mind hanging out there on my left hand while I use my right hand for this mudra? Is that okay? Yeah, great. Okay. So this mudra is done by just curling down your tall finger and your ring finger towards your thumb tip, but you don't quite touch your thumb with those two fingers. Your other two fingers are gently curled down, just not as far as the other two. It is often held like this, but it can be held like this, which really makes it look like presenting the blessing of a bouquet of flowers. To this mudra, I like to add six, six, breathing, inhaling through the nose through count of six, exhaling through the lips through count of six. Let's try it. And yes, and you can do this mudra and this breathing just as frequently as you would like and as many repetitions as you would like. So I hope sometime if people are coming at you with negativity, that you will remember this mudra and this breathing and respond by sending back a blessing. Well, Baba Yaga, it's time to wave goodbye to our friends at home. Would you like to wave? Yeah. Bye-bye, friends. Friends, Baba Yaga, and I hope you have a great rest of the day. We'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.